Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for the birthday people, and this is for the birthday people um, for the week of the 10th until the 16th. I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being here, thank you for being back, thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration for you, birthday people. Um, this is um, the beginning of your year 2019. So, if you have a birthday from the 10th until um, if you have a birthday from the 10th until the 16th, this is the energy vibration of your birthday. Now, as we come in alignment and we're looking at the energies and the issues and the situations that is going on, um, we're basically dealing with um, the enemy. It's as if this year you guys are going to be taking down your enemies okay definitely taking down your enemies because this is exactly what is transpiring and happening here now with the energy of you taking down your enemies i'm seeing also the energy of the mother and father the healing of the mother and father and this has been coming up for a lot of gemini's okay um some of you gemini's who have been dealing with issues um outside your life where it has to do with um, there's a message that came out uh, the energy of the star okay so whatever is happening or whatever is transpiring fate it's about fate it's about this year it's about fate it is a year of the Emperor it's a year of bowing building um, on situation issues but it's, it's also the energy of of fate that is coming up whatever and whoever this message is for out there it's as if they're saying that this year is going to give you the energy of you finding fate within because I'm seeing um, they, they you know I said taking down um, your I said taking down your enemies and definitely this is what is happening that you're basically taking down your enemies so as we look at the energies and this situation because definitely um, a negative um, situation has been going on and this is coming down okay there's a transition that is coming down because some of you were blocked by other people other situations so let's start looking at each individual persons so this is the birthday reading for the Gemini's beginning the 10th until the 16th of June so let's see the energy for the Emperor what comes up and what was happening for the energy of the Emperor we have the energy of the chariot um, in the reverse form um, with the energy of the hamper for you guys, whatever is happening. And we have the energy of the four of pentacles uh, in the reverse form. Okay, so whatever that is and however it is coming up for you, it could be that you're dealing with a father figure or um, the, oh, the situation with people in power and as if you were fighting or you're going to be fighting for, for some injustice and equality okay so that is what is um transpiring um now i hate when people go through my cards because i can always see it um that is why it has been transpiring um for a lot of you there is a lot of um deceptive situation that you guys will be um, working with a lot of deceptive situation that is going to be coming up that you guys have to be working on okay so um, some real dishonest issues and situation so it, it is it can be at your work for some of you some of you um, it can be at your work but some some of it it can be legal issues um, that are coming up um so be aware so if you were born on the 10th of june expect some real you know dishonest play that is going to be coming out uh, which you have to resolve in this year okay because that is a form of that you need to resolve this this situation in this year so um be aware of that i hate when people go through my cards you will have people just come in my apartments and then go through my stuff and then don't return return things um which um is how disrespectful so um whoever you are out there and whatever um you have to be um working out in this year um try and resolve it in this year it has to do with power for some of you some of you it has to do with people 
um, you are at your workplace uh, so um, that's the energy that is coming up for, oh my god hold on a moment let me go for something Okay, so let's um, see what other energies that is going to be coming out for um, you, Geminis. What is this energy with this emperor that is coming out? Um, the power struggle is over. The power struggle is over. So there was someone that was using their powers. However way, is it you? Is it someone else who was using their power? Someone was using their power in an incorrect way. Because you can see the energy of the chariot. And it has to do with someone who is in power or someone who is um, working um, for you. Whoever these people are in these situation was or is they're using their powers in ways that they weren't supposed to do and this is now coming to an end let's see the energy of the empress the energy of the empress there's a new start that is going to be coming in your financial situation so if you were born on the 11th of june um your materialistic needs is going to be very very good um excellent um um, uh, you're finding out something about why your financial uh, or your materialistic world was basically blocked so you could be finding out something about that uh, so um, this is wonderful and, and I think that this this is why the star came out um, because now I understand where the star belongs the star belongs that there's a transition because you had fate for the resolution of a situation now there is a transition that is coming in so the people who were born on the 11th this is just going to be so good this is going to be so good so positive um, you're going to be seeing really um, wonderful situation coming in we have the energy of the ace of uh, um, the ace of Pentacles and the two of swords with the Empress that is saying that news is coming in um, for a lot of you to um, let you know that there is a new beginning with your financial stability okay so there was an issue or there could be issues that is coming up um, where there was um, a block on your financial situation and now um, you're going to be receiving message that this issue is now being resolved okay so for the people who were born on the 13th you have the energy of the moon now the energy of the moon comes up with the um, cancers and the scorpion so you could be having a lot of conflicts with these cancers and scorpions in your life in this year but you could also be having conflicts with people who you weren't aware of that was working against you okay so you could be in at work on the work floor friends family members also because it's amazing to find out the people who works against you because your own family member does that so for the people who were born on the 14th the 13th of June let's see what's coming up for you in this year you're dealing with someone who is um, the knight of swords the knight of swords so you are a Gemini so you young men whatever is transparent you're going to be finding out something about people who were working against you okay so you young men definitely in this year you're definitely going to be finding out about people who has been deliberately working against you for whatever reason it is or um, these people have been lying and deceiving and was really working against you so you young people between the ages of 18 and 45 if you were born on the 13th of June you're going to be finding this out in this year 
and you have to make a decision you definitely have to make a decision whatever the situation is you have to make a decision what it is and how you are going to be moving forward with your life because a decision has to be made okay so we have the knight of swords which is an enemy and the two of pentacles the knight of swords that is an enemy and the two of pentacles so how is this going to be resolved you're going to be coming out on top there is there is success that is going to be coming out you are going to be coming out on top whoever this this uh, this issue whatever issue is there whatever that was going on so for you um people who were born the 13 you have the energy of the star that is helping you moving you forward you definitely have the energy of the star that is helping you moving you forward and this is going to be good and this is going to be wonderful and positive because we are seeing positive the situation moving forward the energy of the world is here and as we look at the energy of the world we're seeing that um for the people who were born on the 14 um this is good for 14 uh, 10 11 12 13 this is good ace of sword this is a wonderful energy because you're coming out and you're speaking your truth okay you're coming out and you're speaking your truth so whatever is transpiring whatever is happening you're coming out and you're speaking your truth and this is very good because what is transpiring is that by you standing out for injustice and equality you're coming out speaking your truth and you're ending a situation so here we have a transition of something ending a cycle ending in your life which is really wonderful and really positive because there was some injustice situation that has taken place if you notice the tower is coming up which again this year whatever energy is from the 10th until the 16th is going to affect each and every one of you who are vibrating with the birthdays from the 10th of June until the 16th of June it's going to affect you guys because what is transpiring and what is happening is that you guys are all vibrating on this year energy you be vibrating with all of these energies so each and every person um, let's say you were born on the 13th what is here on the 13th it's the end of the cycle and a new beginning victory you have overcome a situation you have communicated clearly you have thought out a situation clearly and now the cycle is coming to an end okay so you could be on the 13th then you're going to be working the energy of the 14 energy of 15 energy of the 16 and then you're going to go back to the energy of the 10 11 12 okay and then the center energy that is going to affect everyone so transition could be coming in a lot of you um, situation could be dying out in your life okay so ace of sword um, the world and the debt what is that saying for the Gemini's it was an karmatic issue that you had to deal with and this karmatic issue is going to be over in this year so a lot of you are going to be finding out that you're dealing with these karmatic issues and these karmatic issues are clearing up in this year and it's going to be good let's look at people who were born on the 14th we have the energy of the tower for the people who were born on the uh, on the 14 there is something that is ending and releasing out of your life let it go okay so this year it could be marriage it could be friendship it could be relationship it could be work it could be your end in a study your end in a situation that has been in your life so for the Gemini's who were born on the 14th of June what should I expect in this year release um, the wheel of fortune is coming in so you're releasing something and the wheel of fortune is coming in and bringing you positive alignments of a uh, situation very very much positive alignments of situation so this is good and this is wonderful because what is transpiring is that um, see again so there's a lot of double energies that is coming up in a lot of situations so wheel of fortune is here the tower is here there was an in um, and an, a situation with people in power okay this could be coming from a, a, a past life issue this is a situation that's is a past life issue people in power that was using their 
their power and now these people are being moved out of your life because the wheel of fortune is bringing the tower to remove them out of your life once and for all some of you are going to be very fortunate when it comes down to work people are going to be helping you and people are going to be wanting to connect you with you um, to help you to build something of stability and foundation okay let's see what's the wheel of fortune with the Emperor is very good especially if you're a business person the wheel of fortune with the Emperor is very good if there was some blockage if people were trying to block your life and situations like that what is happening is that the tower is moving whatever that was blocking your um, business or financial flow and you're seeing positive energies coming in so let's see what is transpiring definitely so there is an end that is coming up to a block maybe an organization um, that was blocking you for quite some time some ending is coming up um, whatever the issue is or situation is there is definitely definitely some blocks that is happening that you're releasing yourself there's a, there was an organization that was blocking you and now um, this is being lifted so in business it's going to be a very good year if you decide for the people who were born on the 14th if you decide to start any business anything you decide to start it's going to be good I'm seeing a lot of people buying new houses having your dream house some of you will be winning the lottery all so okay business is going to be good if you decide to do a business yes um, go for it as we look at the people who were born on the 16th the people who were born on the 16th what we have uh, the, the 15th of June we have the energy of La Force La Force is, uh, is finding inner strength now some of you could be connecting where the um, bow of the um, Sagittarians could be coming in to help you some of you are finding inner strength to deal with issues and situation it is a year where it's going to teach you to find inner strength okay and we have the four of swords so some of you needs to start doing something okay it is the year where some of you are going to definitely decide to, uh, to move forward and start making things happen for you in your life and this is going to be very wonderful and very positive so some of you the queen of swords that is the lady so ladies between um, 45 years and older um, it is a year where you guys you Gemini's have to find the inner strength and it's affecting most of the ladies who are 45 years and older it could be affecting people 45 years and older also okay where um, you guys need to find the inner strength to stand up and uh, um, start it's as if you're finding you're trying to find yourself it is a year where a lot of you four five years and older it's going to affect you guys trying to find yourself because you're awakening okay it's as if you were sleeping for quite some time so now you are awake and, and this you can see there is um, then um, let's see the four of swords reverse strength the queen of swords four of um, there is a change that is coming in there is a change that is coming in so you ladies four five years and older there's definitely a change that is coming in for you whatever the issue was in the situation is there is definitely a change that is coming in um, for you um, you have to find inner strength um, obviously there is something that is affecting you ladies and you have to find inner strength in this year okay it's really a year of uh, because balance is also here um, so it is it is really a year that a lot of you are trying to find yourself who you are and there is changes that is coming up and a lot of people are trying to find themselves balance for the people who were born on the 16 I'm seeing balance with relationship is coming in um, this is beautiful it's going to be a year um, where you're connecting with um, your twin flames with your twin flames a lot of you are balancing with your twin flame some of you are going to be having some regrets and this is what I was saying 
um this is what i was saying um because whatever is transpiring or whatever is happening some of you could be in relationships that is going to be ending okay um there's twice the energy of debt i don't always like to say it but whenever twice the energy of debt it could be debt in the family debt in your family debt for a close friend um that is definitely going to be happening it could be happening in this year or this this week okay so if you notice the energy of that is here twice okay so let's see what is happening with the lovers regrets and balance the lovers regrets and balance so you ladies definitely your marriage could be coming to an end in this year so you ladies or men your marriage could be um, coming um, to an end in this year okay um, not so nice energy um, to know but um, here it is um, the lovers regrets um, this energy and the tower is also ending of marriages courthouse um, so it can affect the ladies can affect the men I'm seeing um, the men energies here because again remember all the energy from the 10th until the 16th this is the year energy for you birthday people and every let's say the people who are born on the 16th after this energies over this can begin or it can be simultaneously that all of these energies is affecting you guys so you have to be aware okay so write these numbers down you have two four five thirteen two four five and thirteen okay so you have two four five and thirteen now um what is really really so positive you guys have three times four which is extreme oh 16 also so you have two four five um two four five thirteen and sixteen write these number down use these number in this year it's going to be working for you we have the energy of 17 twice also so we have 16 we have 13 and 17 uh, our energy is also we have the energy of the star so there's a lot of fate we have the energy of the star there's a lot of faith whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring we have a lot of faith that is coming in we have the energy of the star and we have situation with a lot of faith that is coming in because um the universe is um is stepping in it's as if the universe is stepping in now the energy of the emperor some people are going to be having luck at work some people could be having managerial position but some people are dealing with people in power it could be you that has you use your power in the wrong um, the wrong way or someone but whatever it is that is happening with organization or people in power it's coming to an end because there is the tower and here is the tower there is the ending and here is the tower which is an ending that these people and situation whoever that was using their power it could be you that was using your power it's going to it's going to be ending it's going to be ending okay so um there it is oh my god you guys are just so so powerful um yeah let's um see um we're going to be using this earth energy since that is is out um to see what else is coming out um i'm gonna do um two cards to um yeah i'm gonna do a two cards so you can choose because it's your birthday year so you can choose this is card one and this is card two card one says um cosmic consciousness um the cosmo is within you awaken uh, to this consciousness so if you choose card one it's going to be cosmos consciousness the cosmo is within you awaken to this consciousness and this is going to be good okay so um for the people who choose card one i think it's just the time um for you to awaken yourself to the spiritualities and if you notice it as it is at the people who are 45 years and over older 
Okay, here we have transition, and the energy of transition is that you are going through a period of change, you will emerge renewed, okay? So definitely, this is really the perfect message for you guys in this year because obviously a lot of you are going through transition. You're going through a period of changes, you will emerge you will emerge and be renewed so this is good so obviously it could be affecting a lot of you especially in marriage relationship that changes because this is definitely some some of you needs to um, claim and awaken the consciousness within you in this year and some of you need to accept the transition and this transition um, within you you are going through a, um, a period of change you will emerge um, renewed and this is really wonderful and really positive because what is transpiring is that some of you will be awakening the spiritual connection um, with you guys and some of you are going to be understanding where you are on this journey um, ladies and gentlemen thank you so much happy birthday again and namaste until next time